Namaste. I am Achin and I want to be an entrepreneur. I am Mahir and I want to be rich and happy. I am Shivan and I want to be an interior architect. This is a piece of wood and it is not that strong. That is a piece of plywood and it seems quite strong. But what if I spill water on it? But what if we light it on fire? This type of wood is not going to last very long. And to make this incapable wood, a lot of problems are caused while harvesting. For example, deforestation, habitat destruction, climate change, soil erosion, over harvesting, waste generation. By making this inefficient piece of wood, the wood industry is thriving with problems. What if we were able to make wood that is sustainable, affordable, and maximizes profits? Introducing Woodchuck. Around Rs. 102 is the cost price of making the wood. To make this piece of wood, we require bagas, which is a sugarcane byproduct. And plastic from landfills. After the collection, we take the material to the factory. We take the sugarcane and the plastic, take it to the MRF machine, which shreds it into pieces. Then we take it to the extruder where the mixture is melted and that's where we add two chemicals compatibilizers and uv stabilizers after the melting process is done the wood is molded into fibers and plywood and then the wood is given final touches and we have our plywood ready now a question arises why, why us? us well our piece of wood is fire resistant water resistant uv resistant load maintenance durable recyclable and well, what else could we have asked for? 